Hey everyone, it's Andrew Nagel with Valk9 Designs, and I wanted to do another short talking point for you all and let you know what you can do with your leftover liver of sulfur mixture. So as you've seen in the videos, you know that I do my liver of sulfur mixture in a glass jar. On the left, we have some, we'll call it activated liver of sulfur mixture. On the right, we have some deactivated liver of sulfur mixture. You can tell the activated sulfur um, by the yellow color to the liquid. And so what we're going to need to do is just neutralize this with a base. And one of the most common bases that I'm sure you all have in your house is baking soda. This is a very simple process. All we're going to have to do is just add about a tablespoon of baking soda to this jar. Doesn't even necessarily have to be a tablespoon. I just do a tablespoon because that seems to be the you know, easiest scoop to put in there. And so just gonna put some baking soda in there and then you you might see a slight reaction. It's not gonna be anything as, as violent or as reactive as when you put baking soda in with vinegar, um, but you might see some bubbles as you can kind of see going on there. And so do be ready for that. It's not gonna like fizz over and spill onto your counter though. Just give it a quick swirl make sure that baking soda gets mixed up in there. You can already see that it's losing some of its yellow color. And so what you're gonna do is just let this sit overnight. And then in the morning, it should be more of the clear color as you see on the right. And once you get the clear color to the water, you're ready to dispose of it. And you're going to want to dispose of this mixture by pouring it down your toilet drain, not your sink drain, your toilet drain. The pipes do go different places, generally in most cities, and different chemicals are used to sanitize that water. And so you're going to want to put this down your toilet drain, and you're done. So I hope you all enjoyed this little informative video, and thank you all so much, and have a great weekend.